Based upon current immigration information, the population of the Cowichan region will grow at least 1.4% per year, bringing the population of the region to 100,000 or more by 2030. Approximately 17% of the population may be immigrants. Immigrants from England, the U.S., India, and Philippines have traditionally settled here, but more immigrants from China are expected to settle in smaller communities, such as Cowichan, in the future. Immigrants will come to Cowichan as skilled workers or to join family members already settled here. Our mild weather, beautiful landscape, and diversity of cultures will attract immigrants from all over the world. Seventeen seventy four explorers arrived from Spain and England. Eighteen forty three Fort Victoria established as the Hudson Bay Company trading post. Eighteen forty nine Vancouver Island became a colony. Eighteen fifty eight Substantial wave of adventures came from Britain and the U.S. looking for gold. 1858. First Chinese man arrived, attracted by gold. Late 1850s to 1862. First British settlers arrived. Late 1850s, First Nations people helped early settlers with food. 1862 to 1870, four ships arrived from Britain with a hundred young women destined to become wives of settlers. 1869, approximately 200 British subjects lived in the Cowichan Valley. 1885 to 1923, Chinese immigrants subjected to head tax to limit their immigration. 1890, First Japanese arrived and settled in Crofton and Shimanus to become fishermen and farmers. 1892, Japanese miners recruited from Kyushu, Japan. 1904, first Sikhs began to arrive. 1917, Mao Singh built a mill at Paldi. Paldi became a model of diversity with Japanese, Chinese, and South Asians working in harmony. Early 1900s, British cement workers arrived at work at Bamberton. 1890s to World War I, Canada launched a marketing campaign to attract settlers to Canada. World War I, descendants of early settlers fought and died for Canada. Easter 1942, Japanese immigrants interned. After World War II, many people from Europe immigrated to Canada. 1960s, draft dodgers, or conscientious objectors, arrived from the U.S. Late 1970s, Vietnamese refugees arrived. Immigration will play a vital role in the economy of the Cowichan Valley in the future. As Canada's birth rate declines and many people retire, immigrants' work skills will be essential. According to the Business Council of BC, our labor force growth in the future will come almost exclusively from those who choose to come to Canada. To continue to strengthen our community, we must accept and appreciate all the gifts diversity brings to it.